at home, friends. I'm still in Italy for another 10 days, but I want to stick to my routine of getting these lessons out. Let's start with our slow, deep breath. Om Tatsa. Om Shanti. This is episode number 143, entitled, Yagna is not so selfless after all. And now we're on the 10th verse of the third chapter. I'll read it to you. Having created mankind together with Yagna, the Creator said, By this you shall prosper and your wishes be fulfilled. So in this verse, Sri Krishna continues to talk about Yagna, a divinely inspired sacred action. I don't know about you, but the spirit of, of sacrifice and service has never come easy for me due to my self-absorption with taking care of number one I used to cringe when my guru, Swami Satsadananda, would talk about karma yoga, which is pretty much every time he spoke. With reticence, I accepted that service was the, the dues I needed to pay to join the Spiritual Seekers Club. It was the hazing that new members are forced to endure to be accepted, accepted in the fraternity. Once I was a full-fledged member, then I could get down to the real practice of yoga. So Sri Krishna makes two points in this verse that help people like me view yajna or karma yoga in a better light. First, he says that yajna was created together with mankind. What that means to me is that it's natural. It's not something that has to be stuffed down our throats. It's in our DNA. I think of yajna as being synonymous with pure love. It's the way that the divine life force expresses itself through its manifestation. It recognizes that all beings are interconnected threads of the cloth of creation. Albert Einstein discovered that when two atoms were moved far away from each other, they still communicated without any gap in time. The second point that Krishna makes is that yajna is not so selfless after all. He says that by yajna I'm going to prosper and get what I want. By acting in a way that brings benefit to all, I'm included in that all. For the homework assignment, Mother Teresa said, give until it hurts. As we're attempting to act selflessly, there may be a part that hurts. But see if there's also a part that finds joy in the act. Thanks for joining. See you soon. Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti.